play. Is it? Uh, actually, RuneScape? Yeah, this is RuneScape. This, this, uh... Kit, in... No. <laughs> yeah, can you? <laughs> they can't. Or... Not anymore. Okay, okay. Not anymore. Okay. We got rid of that scene. No. no, no I think so. Uh, Don't worry, Eric. We can bring it back just for you. I. Oh, to be we honest. Get, we can see we can take one of those yeah. To, Yo, to, that's to, a good idea. To be honest with you, like if a match gets too boring, I'd be totally down to <laughs> to commentate uh, Gaunt playing RuneScape. Me too. Yeah, just him grinding or whatever. Yeah, definitely. I'd be down. Now this is actually no like no troll. I kind of want to commentate this. But okay, we got Jelly Packet. I guess now his tag is just Packet. Just Packet. Okay. Is it just Packet? April, you know. I guess. I, I recognize Jelly Packet. Right. So uh, Packet, he's one of our sort of up and coming raw players. Okay. Um, I've been kind of watching him for a while. Kind of, he definitely wants to get better. Um, and then Polonian, obviously, no introduction needed there. For Spell. Hard uh, matchup, right? You play Falco, so. Uh, hard for Rob? Yeah, or it seems like it. Well, in, at least in neutral. Yeah, I, I mean, you know, there, there, there's always good things that Falco has, especially in advanced, it's just because Rob's a big... And, and, and close, uh, when you're, you're close together, Rob actually has better. Kind of yeah. rough to start your combo, especially when, you know, they all come. So. It's true. But I see the reflector is just even good uh, as a boxing tool. Sure. Which, uh, uh, very useful. I, I, I gotta say, it's, it's, it's kind of tough being an upcoming Rob main. And right. Just, yeah. Everyone plays against Gabriel, everyone does a matchup. Yeah, they Gabriel. Not that he's a peak of all Robs, but you know. Good timing, yeah. You would expect him to hit that there. But. Yeah, that's pretty crucial in this matchup. You get that every time. <laughs> I also would like to note, um, after uh, Packet took the stock, he immediately set up Gyro and then... Uh, a bead to sort of stall out the invincibility. Very Gabriel-esque as well, so good on him. Yeah. So, it's always good to be very defensive during the front's invincibility to shield on the platform. Yeah, so. always active. Like, even if uh, yeah. your opponent is in on the stage. Uh, yeah, definitely. Can you grab that? Yeah. Throw, no combo there. Coming from Jelly Packet. Yeah, I would like to see Jelly Packet commit more to the potential air dodge there, honestly. Damn. The juggle. Yeah, he missed for some reason. He missed the uh, fastball air dodge attack. Guy good. Dad. Yeah, good the eye. He, he uh, didn't get the cross up. So uh, again, you always want to face where the where Rob's arms are. So if he's going to the left, you want to di to the up left. Oh wow, good string. That's exactly what Polony needed here. And footing, and that should be a stock. Uh, okay. I wasn't sure for a second. Rob is you know, kind of fatty. You know? Maybe it wasn't the uh, best DI. It probably needed to be like really impeccable. Though. And that was also good DI. He got uh, in the in the cross up hitbox and he recognized it. That is really good. He has, like, he has a pretty good grasp on, on Falcon's recovery, actually. Uh, he hasn't dropped yeah. a lot of these uh, edge guards. That's a, that's a very good point. And the only ones that he has dropped is where he's like really hard committing for like a side B. And, like Falco's uh, recovery. The Falco, the Falco recovery is bad, but um, you do need to know the timing too. Uh, he like has a he has a lot of unexpected burst, like with his jump. Um, but yeah, you need to you need to be really definitely a timing you need to be ready for. I could definitely is, you know, out here ready. But uh, is that it? Yep. Yeah. Fresh bear, fresh up tilts. You got the stock. Yeah, that can be pretty scary too, you know, when you're Falco spamming up tilt. Scary to go for that because it is unsafe on shield, but you know, like that punish and have kind of the death of you. Yeah, definitely. Um, like you pointed out, I really like Jelly Packets. Uh, sorry, Packets. Um, edge guarding. His uh, his commitments were on point and his timing and his like. I, I have to say, you know, you, I, I, okay, we're, we're getting the palace. That's it. I, I have to say, like, like. It's hard for Robs coming up, but there also are a lot of Falcos here. A lot of Falcos. Yeah. So there's you, Pelo, the Thedium. The Thedium, Thexon. Thexon. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Abnormal <laughs> amount. <laughs> this matchup also definitely, uh, I'd say, in Palutena's favor. Yeah. Um, I know this is a relatively um, 
decent character for a uh, fellow. I know he's been experimenting recently. Uh, Palu, uh, I, th I think I've seen him experiment with Trainer too. Yeah, Palu, like me, has also played like sort of a huge variety of characters. Um, and Palu's sort of his recent experiment. I, I, not that he's going to drop Falco, but um, I, I think he's trying to find a, a good character to stop. Yeah, he'll never drop Falco. Def definitely one of those people. No, not at all. But, uh, but I don't think he can only. I think there's. I'm too annoyed. I really like Jelly Packet, um, sort of feigning air dodge landing on the stage and then going to the ledge. That was very good. Allowed him to recover. Pello was also definitely aware of fast full air dodge, so I like Packet not doing that. Pello just went for a really high up set. A lot of really high up. And yeah, I mean, it's good because it'll it'll catch a neutral get up and all of you do it at the correct uh, and also just that. I can Pello, uh, or from Packet, either uh, Pello smashing, but uh, eight on that punish, and there's it. Yeah, really no reason to spot dodge, and against a character who's doing lingering aerials like that, you want to just make a guild. Um, even at that percent, like, Crab won't net death, but the aerials will. And this is what can be kind of frustrating for this matchup, because yeah, you, you do have this big body. Air is also a big hitbox. Uh -huh. You get caught by any of it. Most likely it's probably going to lead to a big fat combo, but that up air is going to kill that. It didn't look like the best DI there. Yep, he hit the he hit the cross up uh, hitbox, which is again on the outer arm. Um, if you're in the outer arm, you get the cross up and Peloton react. But I'd like to see Packet just generally play more evasively in this in this matchup. Uh, use the platform more to his advantage. Uh, he's like trying to outbox Palutena, which is not going to work for you. Aerials are too strong. Too easy to get punched by anything, right? Yeah, for real. Oh, very, very, very good turnaround grab there. It's practically a 50 50. A Pelo at the ledge here, you know. Bad damage. I would have really. So Pelo has actually recovered to the Town City side platform multiple times now, and I would have really liked to see Packet sort of overcommit. Um, yeah, actually overcommit there for, for an early stock with a side B. Um, you see there, he's he's uh, also leaning more towards the platform. He can just make more reads based on that. I could drop again. See, yeah. want to point that out again. Right, packet watches. I mean, packet does seem like he's playing like a little more slowly. Yeah, like, and, and more evasively for sure. Up till up here. Yeah. I think oh. he, I think he does realize that he's getting caught by two maybe. I like Packet actually going for the the read there, the air dodge out of his down throw, because Pelo has been doing that uh, like three or four times now. Uh, but he unfortunately did not read the correct side. It was going to pop out. I think that he could have gotten up tilt, potentially up air. Oh, wow. wow! But he didn't go for it. That was amazing confirmed. That's cute. Cute. I also, yeah, I think that was completely. That was really, really clean. Yeah. I wonder, I wonder if that's a pre lab thing or if that's a reaction thing. Probably a, a mixture of both. He probably labbed it and also reacted. I would think so. Like something you practice. Yeah, we, us in CFL, we don't see it because Gabriel doesn't utilize them, but Rob actually does have falling up ourselves. Good point. He actually doesn't do it. Yeah, it literally never goes for it, but it, it can be good in these situations like that. Especially on characters like Tyler, who uh, has a pretty tall hitbox, so. So I want to see, Pelo's going to fish with a kill here. I want to see Packet actually play really, really defensively and stay, sort of maintain stage control, but disadvantage now, it's hard to avoid. Oh! Either way, it was going to be really hard to avoid that. Uh, he was going to have to deal with uh, ledge trap with down tilt, but unfortunate. It had to end like Packet's, rea Packet's reaction. Uh,